This is such a great... <laughs> Do you have any balls lying around? All right, everybody heads up. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, oh. Well, that's one of my biggest takeaways on, on this whole trip is thinking back, we've done so much in a couple of days. The overall like vibe and openness and like welcoming, you know, spirit. You gotta you gotta understand, like this is we're entering other people's livelihoods and like it's like their baby, you know? When, when we walk onto on their channel, it's like more than welcoming us into their home. The, the overall feeling of like inclusiveness and it's it's yeah it, it's so good to just see how open and uh, welcoming everybody was. It's been fun to get into their world. The one left. It's gonna be sad when it's done. Yeah, it is kind of gonna be sad. <laughs> We get it, Michael. You're more attractive than us. You don't have to show off. Let's be yourself. Wow. It's fair. Why? I like San Francisco. You emotional? I'm mostly just tired. Still got work to do. It's hard for me to get emotional when I got work to do. Okay. I'm a good German. Yeah. And I'm a good Jew. We make a wonderful <laughs> pair. <laughs> good to meet you. Yeah. Ooh, I might hey. Good to meet you. I want you to put your spin on my tennis. All right. <laughs> Yeah, I haven't been to like a tennis specialty this shop so cool. in forever. It's so nice just oh, to see man. all the the different I want to touch everything. <laughs> I want to be, I want to bathe in this. <laughs> You've been managing for like 10 or 12 years, right? It opened in 2006 and I've been part of it since 2007, eight. So about a year and a half in. The ironic thing is they, the two people that opened it came to me and said, we're going to open up a shop in San Rafael. I'm like, that is the stupidest thing you can do. Don't do it. <laughs> right? But right after they opened it, the funny thing was people came, even though there was competition, which none of us understood why. Well, congrats. <laughs> yeah. You must be you. doing something right if you stayed open. Yeah, I think that's just do it. That's what we're doing right this day. <laughs> <Is that open? laughs> I mean, these guys are the ones that do most of the leg work. I just, yeah. I'm just a pretty face and, <laughs> and just oh, like, shoot my mouth off. <laughs> yeah. I just shoot my mouth off and they just make it look good. <laughs> nice. You gonna buy the spoon? Oh my God. This is such a great. <laughs> <laughs> do you have any balls lying around? Uh, Why you're gonna miss anyway? <laughs> <laughs> Here. All right. I'm, I'm Everybody done. Out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm swinging hard. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> oh, Harry, Harry called it. Harry called it. How good a training aid is this? Oh, it's very good. It's very good, especially if you're like the typical tennis player who does this. <laughs> right. I promised myself I would not spend money in here. It's like, a, it's like you're doing an interview, you're not gonna put this. It's a business expense, come this on. Is, I can expense this. <laughs> this seems so useful. Uh, yeah. All right, everybody heads up. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, if I did 20 minutes on a soft toss machine every day for um, six weeks, no. I would greatly improve. Yeah, eye on the ball. Bring one up, Harry. <laughs> I was never in a fraternity, so never got a paddle, but now I feel like that you can start your own. You never got paddled, you mean? No. I'm not that I'm complaining, but. It's not too late, Joel. <laughs> Shut off the camera. <laughs> Thank you.
Thank you. Give us, a, give, us, give us a little behind the scenes. What's what's going on in the back room right now with uh, with Harry? What's, what's oh, um, so we're doing another parody spot uh, when he is dressing up as a. I guess you call it a mascot. Would you call it a mascot? I guess you call it a mascot. Yeah. But um, it it seems like he's having a little bit of trouble uh, with the <laughs> with the outfit. Is that, is that, he, he always that? has a lot of trouble with the outfit. <laughs> 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 I'm here with Harry of Tennis Spin, and I had my eye on something I never knew existed, but it's a sweet spot spoon. Helps you hit the tennis racket sweet spot, and Harry gives it to me after our uh, afternoon together. Very Thank generous. You so much, Harry. Yeah. Yeah. No, Joel was a bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Grab whatever you want a polo, if you want a shirt, please help yourself. Thanks, man. That's nice of you. Please. So. This thing's called the Lit Device, L-I-T-T. -T. We pop the normal butt cap off of the trap door, yeah. off the normal racket. We put the Lit Device in. We set it when you get a fresh string drop. As you play, it'll take a parameter of the tension that you're getting. Yeah. So as, let's say, the shock worsens, the sound gets higher pitched, the more vibration comes into the handle that this feels, it'll start changing color. Huh. Here's one of them. So pitch and vibration, it, it hears mm -hmm. and picks up on? Mm -hmm. Interesting. That's the coolest stuff, man. <laughs> Well, thanks for having us over. Oh, no, thanks for coming, yeah, dude. Thanks yeah. for reaching it was, out. It was a good time. It was amazing. Oh, thank you. I had such a good time. Thank you so much. You guys are doing an incredible job. Yeah, yeah, all, yeah, all of you. Like, you, you can really tell you guys work well together, and the, it shows through in the content, too. Oh, thank so you. Keep up the good work. Oh, yeah. You, too. Like, yeah. I hope thanks. you get, uh, get a second wind and continue for another 14 years, man. Thank you. Yeah, yeah you too. Uh, like I said, you I'm too. a fan first. So thank you, I appreciate very it. Cool. Thanks a lot. Thank you, guys. Right, thank hey, you. take care. Thank take care. You. Wow. Wow. That's all I can say. Wow. Guess we're done. Guess we're done. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what a, what that a, was it. What a world whirlwind! Like there was yeah. not a minute of we were either driving or on a flight or having a thousand dollar dinner with Baxter and the <laughs> or eating in an illicit pizzeria in DC. Like there was just no, no, <laughs> no downtime. How do you top that? that? You don't that trip. I mean, and it's the people we were hanging out with that that like they're they're the ones that uh, provided all those experiences. You know. That's beautiful here, man. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's absolutely gorgeous. It really is. I cannot believe how beautiful it is out here. I wonder if it wears off.